2019 WASI core mathematics theory question 2 a and it reads z varies directly as x and inversely as twice the cube root of y if z is equal to 8 when x is equal to 4 and y is equal to 1 over 8 find the relation for y in terms of x and z mathematically the variation will be presented as z varies directly as x and inversely as twice the cube root of y which in an equation form will be z is equal to constant k multiplying x over 2 multiplying cube root of y we can label it as our equation 1 from the question when z is equal to 8 x is equal to 4 and y is equal to 1 over 8 so wherever we see z x and y we put 8 4 and 1 over 8 respectively into the equation 1 which will now give us 8 is equal to k multiplying 4 over 2 multiplying k root of 1 over 8 we all know k root of 1 over 8 will give us 1 over 2 multiplying 2 will cancel out which will now give us 8 is equal to 4k how do we make k the subject by dividing both sides of the equal sign by the coefficient of k which is 4 so divided by 4 our k will be equal to 2 which is our constant now we will put constant k back into the equation 1 which will now give us z is equal to 2 multiplying x over 2 multiplying k root of y 2 and 2 cancel out here which will be left with z is equal to x over k root of y now we want to make y the subject that's from the question so you interchange the positions of z and k root of y which will give us k root of y is equal to x over z now how do we make y the subject We make y the subject by raising both sides of the equal sign to an index or a power of 3 to get rid of the cube root sign which will then give us y equals s cube over z cube b factorize completely 4b squared minus ab plus bracket open a plus 9b bracket closed squared minus a squared we have 4b squared minus ab plus bracket open a plus 9b bracket closed squared minus a squared first of all we will tackle the one in the bracket which is a plus 9b squared when we expand that we get a plus 9b multiplying a plus 9b now we have 4b squared minus ab plus a plus 9b in bracket multiplying a plus 9b minus a squared now when we expand that we have 4b squared minus ab plus a times a will give us a squared a times 9b will give us 9ab plus 9b times a will give us 9ab plus 9b times 9b will give us 81b squared minus a squared now we can simplify 4b squared minus ab plus a squared plus we have 9ab plus 9ab which will give us 18ab plus 81b squared minus a squared now we can group like terms 4b squared plus 81b squared minus ab plus 18ab plus a squared minus a squared 4b squared plus 81b squared will give us 85b squared minus ab plus 18ab will give us 17ab then plus a squared minus a squared will give us zero now 
85b squared plus 17ab. We can factorize 17b out. And we will be left with 5b plus a. So by factorizing completely, we can see we have 17b multiplying the sum of 5b and a. Thank you.